welcome back tonight. And since the pandemic started, OPPD and MUD say there's been a 38% increase in the number of customers needing help with their utility bills. KETV News Watch 7's Quinesia Frazier has more on this year's virtual event, easing some of that burden. From wherever you are, whether it's out in the neighborhood or even on the treadmill, you can take part in this year's virtual. Heat the streets, run and walk for warmth. Who does it mean to get out for a beautiful walk on a beautiful day like today just to be in nature and just take care of yourself? MUD co-chair Tanya Cook says the pandemic has only increased the need for so many already struggling financially. People don't have a lot of savings. They certainly don't have a year's worth of savings to support their family with utility bills in this uncertain weather being unpredictable. Funds raised from Heat the Streets are administered by the Dollar Energy Fund. That fund provides money utility customers can apply directly to their bills. So at the end of this, there's going to be a large group of people who will still need um, enormous amounts of help with their utility bills because they've not because they haven't spent the money. They spent the money inappropriately. They've spent it on other things that they really needed during the pandemic. Major Greg Thompson with the Salvation Army says it means a lot to partner with OPPD and MUD for a cause like this one. I love the idea of still having these opportunities to do um, to allow people to be as generous as they are in the, in the Omaha area. Quinesia Fraser, KETV Newswatch 7. Good effort there in the heat. The streets event is going on all day today until midnight. The virtual 5K is $35 and the one mile walk is $25.